And in 2022, residents in the village of Sutherland voted to enact an economic development program that imposed a sales tax of 1.5% on eligible transactions within the Lincoln County community. This week, the first trio of projects that received grant funding from that tax were displayed and highlighted in the midst of a tour of Sutherland. Our own Tristan Winder was among those in attendance and joins us from Sutherland with details. From restaurants to grocery stores to fuel destinations and so much more, the business climate within the village of Sutherland continues to thrive and expand. In recent years, Sutherland residents have enacted a new economic development strategy directed at maintaining quality of life for Sutherland citizens and a strong workforce while developing community resources and public facilities, broadening the tax base and ensuring economic stability. One of the chief tools to accomplish this goal is a one and a half percent sales tax approved by the voters in 2022 to modernize the 133 year old Lincoln County community. It's, it's time that we made some investment in our community. And so this is the first award from the Economic Development Department's Property Improvement Program. And we are just very thankful that Streeter Electric has chosen Sutherland to be their headquarters. The grant funding is not just limited to businesses. Sutherland is growing. We have a lot of businesses that are wanting to open and some improvements to a lot of the businesses around town. We have um, homeowners that are making improvements to their properties and actually new properties um, being put in as well. It's nice that we can finally take advantage of some of the fruits of our labor, so to speak, and put, put it to use to better the community. The grant funding is even helping revitalize a Lincoln County cornerstone. And we were so happy um, that this young couple bought the Snow White at a perfect time. It had been vacant for several years and we had the money to help them out and we're so glad that they have done all this work which of course is much more expensive than the amount that we have here. But we were very happy to be able to partner with them in this uh, renovation and to have Snow White open once again. In total, nearly $20,000 were distributed from the economic development program that has been funded by the previously mentioned sales tax. In Sutherland, I'm Tristan Winder reporting for KNOP News 2.